So Chelsea, when somebody approaches you with the question, I want to become a better service designer, what is the most important tip you can give them? I think good service designers are comfortable uh, living with ambiguity. They're comfortable uh, moving forward in making things even though they don't know that they what they need to know. Um, so I would say explore your own capacity for doing that. How how able are you to make work when you don't have all the answers that you actually need to make that work? Um, I think it's also uh, important for service designers to be um, broad people. Like it's not enough to be a super skilled researcher or um, a really good visual designer. I think the best designers that I've worked with are people who have wide ranging interests about the world because you're, mm. you really have a responsibility to feed your brain with all kinds of divergent information so that you can actually be more creative. If you, if you live yeah. in sort of a narrow rut, then your brain's going to be in a narrow rut and you're not going to be as generative in the context of your work. What do you think? Was this a helpful tip? Leave a comment down below or click that like button and let me know what you think. If this is your first time here, I would love to have you to subscribe to the channel so we can keep bringing you more videos like this. Thanks so much for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.